You didn't see anything. Okay. But thank you for coming out. <laughs> we are at Liberation. Uh, I'm Matt. I'll be your spirit guide for the night. Uh, we have Katie and Shanna, and Taylor and Rachel, and Mona, Tim, Will. Will. <laughs> so let's give it up for them. Okay, let's get right into it. So we need an audience volunteer to help us out. We'll go with, with that guy back there. That guy that has you. <laughs> okay, this is a game for everyone, including um, Casey. I know your name, but his name's Casey. So let's say hi to Casey. Hi, hi, hi Casey. 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 Okay, can I get everybody up here? Uh, this game is called Wild Sex on Stage. So we're gonna get right into it. <laughs> Jelly. Uh, I'm just doing this. <laughs> Thanks for being a sport. The real Good. name of the game, no. Oh, okay. You are going to help us with something. The real name of the game is called Chain Murder Mystery. And for this, we're going to need Rachel oh. Taylor and Will. And the way this works is you are going to get this explained to you in the hall. So uh, we're going to have Rachel and Will take you out of the hall, explain how this works. So you go out there now. Bye, Casey. Bye. Bye. Okay. Good. The way this is going to work is there has been a murder. <gasps> and Taylor is going to have to communicate what has happened because he's the only person that has seen what's happened. Except he doesn't. He doesn't remember how to talk. He's so shocked. You get to bring her from. <laughs> exactly. So can we have a location for where this murder took place? The Sydney Mary Opera Poppins House. house. Oh, I heard Opera House. So Opera House is where this has taken place. Okay, can I get an occupation for the murder? Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins. <laughs> <laughs> and finally, the weapon. The GOP the elephant. Hammers that uh, the Koopas throw. <laughs> the G-O-G elephant. It's <laughs> a good luck with that. So I'm going to give you words back for a little bit. Here you go. Hey, thank hey you. there you go. So what's the location the of this location bird? The location is an opera house. Okay, and the occupation? The occupation is, I completely forgot. Mary Poppins. Mary Poppins. <laughs> okay. And, and the, the weapon? weapon is the GOP elephant. Loaded. Correct. Just I'm going to take a minute. Remember. This is for Mime and Gibberish, she's got to convey everything. So on the count of three, we're going to yell murder, 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 and get the first person in here. So one, two, three. Murder, murder, murder! Okay, come on, come on, Uh, 
Murder Mystery. And uh, thank you, Casey, so much. <laughs> Next, we're going to go into our, our format <gasps> of Tool Chest. Yeah. Um, <laughs> What we do is we have these calls that we'll call out like uh, a screening moment, and then we'll have to be like, oh, really emotional. And uh, <laughs> you'll hear us say this stuff off stage, and it will influence the scene that we have going on right here. And we're going to start our scene with Mona up here, and you guys are going to help form her character. Now, can I have a name for Mona? I'm Meg. Lisa. Chelsea. Meg. You are Meg. <laughs> And an adjective to describe Meg. Voracious. Pugnacious. <laughs> I'm gonna go with pugnacious. <laughs> and an occupation. Fire. Ballerina. Fire woman. Fire, Fire, Fire woman. <laughs> and the people in the front row are special. <gasps> because yeah. they are also going to have some of the powers that we have off stage. So who really wants to do a power called inner monologue? I'll explain. Thank you. What's your name? Billy. Hey, Billy. Hey, Billy. Hey, Billy. Hey, Billy. Hey. You got it. <laughs> um, inner monologue. When you shout that, whoever's speaking or doing an action is going to have to come forward, and they're going to have to tell you guys, the audience, their inner thoughts, and then step back. So you can yell that at any time. So next, we need someone for Oscar-winning moment. What's your name? Owen. Hi, Owen. Hi, Owen. And so at any time, you can yell out, Oscar winning moment. And we and the scene are going to have to get really emotional, whatever we're feeling, sad or happy. It's a musical play. Exactly. Ooh. It'll be just like we're trying to win our Oscar. And finally, show me that. Your name. What is your name? I'm Kate. Hi, Hi Kate. Kate. Hi, Kate. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, Kitty. Okay, this is arguably the best power. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever anything happens, we're like, yeah, it was like that fish I had when I was a kid. You can yell, show me that, and then we have to somehow show you the fish I had when I was a kid. Anytime during the scene. So you guys know what your powers? Yeah. So help us out. <laughs> Way to be Owen. So we're going to start this. Uh, Taylor and Mona are going to start this out. What? Oh, okay, yes, thank you. Uh, we have one last thing that's to involve the audience. It's called hesitation. Whenever we're kind of stuck, we're going to do this, and you're going to shout something at us to help us out. So I'm like, my... Grandmother. Grandmother. And that's how it's going to work. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Taylor and Mona will start this out. And you! Newbie! The pugnacious one. I forget your name already. Meg. Meg. Why aren't you out fighting fires? I, I, was, I, was, I was teaching the kids about the importance of not playing with fire, sir. Kids don't need to do that. We need something to do. They need to start okay. fires. We fight them. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Now, okay. slide down the pole and into your fire clothes. <laughs> I have to go down the pole? Okay, okay, sir. Okay. So pugnacious are words that mean not liking to go down poles. <laughs> you will go down that pole, okay. just like we drank. Okay, show me that. <laughs> yeah, going down that pole. <laughs> 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 Any broken bones? No. Okay. <laughs> no broken bones. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Slide down the pole. Slide down the pole, just like I just thought that would happen. Okay. <laughs> It'll go on the fire truck, sir. <laughs> Reverse. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sir. I'll Forward. <laughs> Reverse. <laughs> Inner monologue. <laughs> This is freaking ridiculous. Forward. This is freaking ridiculous. Wee! Wee! Ask for any moment. <laughs> You're wheezing. What? You bring something out in my very soul, Jimmy. <laughs> Meg. Uh, Hug. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I think I love you. What? You heard me. So, uh, have you talked to that pugnacious little Meg? I did. What'd she say? We're getting married in a week. <laughs> 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 
That's surprising, because I told you to fire her. <laughs> Sorry, Chief, I couldn't bring myself to do it. I see, and Just, she's so pugnacious. I understand. And that little wee she makes when she goes down the pole. <laughs> and it's, it's very cute. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> You know, some of the boys, they find it kind of annoying. Show me that. <laughs> I hate that. Seriously, uh, where's that stupid wee pug? <laughs> oh my gosh, she did it again. Come back. <laughs> and we can't have our boys. We'll get new boys. New boys, new boys? can appreciate the finer things in life. Like wee Show pugs. me that. <laughs> You like wee pugs? I like drama and art. Art? That is awesome! You're hired! Go away! <laughs> I guess we can hire new boys. New boys! What are we gonna do with the old boys? Fire them. Can I trust you to do this? Because I know you've had a little trouble in the past firing people. Is it okay if I'm falling in love with you a little bit too? <laughs> about some of your, some of your Okay, friends. out with it, out with it. Well, you know, they, they came to our school to talk to the kids about fire safety, but they wound up just teaching them how to start fires. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> now you can just use a magnifying glass. <laughs> but honestly, don't tell anyone I gave it this. <laughs> I'm not even teaching these kids anymore. Come back, come back. Well, to be fair, they're new boys. Um, we just got rid of our old boys, and uh, they're still in training. I mean, we got them to recognize fire, just not to put it out. Show me that. <laughs> um, okay, so. This hot stuff is called fire. And our job is to pay attention. Pay Ice attention cream! With <laughs> okay. So it's a process. We're getting there. Okay, We're getting sorry. there. I know, you know, I should let you do your job. But Thank you. I appreciate that. Don't you think that you should probably make sure they know how to do that stuff before you hire them? Look, just, do I come to your saying. school and tell you how to do <laughs> no, your job? No, but you job? come to my school and tell my kids how to start fire. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Patterson, um, I think that Billy might have set Susie on fire, but I can't find her. Show me that. <laughs> <laughs> Susie, Susie, Billy, have you seen Susie? No. Oh, what's that? Oh. What's that? What? What? No. What? In a Billy. monologue. <clears throat> Okay, really? I just wanted to do art education as a major. I was not set up for this kind of crap. <laughs> Billy, where is Susie? Where is Susie? Go back. <laughs> and I, I just left for a second. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm so well, sorry. Just, do you hear screaming? <laughs> now I do. <laughs> I, they're so small. I don't know. There are so many cupboards here. Okay, okay. Are, about asking Sandra to marry me. What do you think? <laughs> You're right, it's too soon. <laughs> <sighs> 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 
I don't know, man. <laughs> 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 Yesterday, I found a nickel. <laughs> so here's your umbrella. You need your bag, too. I'm gonna watch out for these kids while I'm back. Are you up for the job? Do they think that you think they'll know I'm not a woman? <laughs> <laughs> Sir, um, this is a family place. Sir, uh, uh, sir, you're gonna have to leave. What? But, but, but she's supposed to sit children. No, this is a man. I know she, a man when I she. see a man. Okay. Be respectful. She wanted to be. He has a mustache. <laughs> <laughs> I am Mrs. Doubtflame. <laughs> <laughs> sir, I'm gonna have to ask Mrs. you to exit the ball pit. He's not buying. <laughs> By this court, I sentence you to never see your children again, Donald Doubtfum. <laughs> Only through some sort of complicated ruse will you ever encounter them. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> Ted! My son! I mean, who are you, little boy? You're really close to my face, stranger. I'm... Okay, lay it off. Do you like Pepperidge Farm? Yeah, me and my dad used to eat Pepperidge Farm all the time. Together. What a coincidence! <laughs> so, uh, I heard from some of the new boys that, uh, you're now marrying all of the old boys. <laughs> Show me that! God, I love you so much. It's a big day for us. Can I get some hug? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, Go back. <laughs> all the boys, we, we, we love each other deeply. This is more As my fault than your fault. Not a <laughs> moment. If I just would have told you how to fire people instead of marry them, <laughs> you wouldn't be in this predicament. You don't understand. <laughs> I love it. I think we got off on the wrong foot. Absolutely the wrong foot. So I, I'm sorry, and I know, I know how you like to hire people with absolutely no experience fighting I like fires. Clean slate. So I'm wondering if I can have a job. <laughs> uh, could you tell me your qualifications? Have you ever um, fought fires before? I've never fought fires. I was so far. I was um, the principal of a school, but I let two children die. Show me that. <laughs> Don't do it! Don't do it! She's on fire! I can't help you! I can't help Well, I like what I'm hearing. Great! When do I start? Let's say 10-ish. <laughs> That's in about five minutes. I give or take. Hey boss, I got ice rail! <laughs> still in training. Hey chief, here's the... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you are not to fire her. <laughs> I'm Kim Patterson. Hi. John. 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 Oh, Just... right. Yes, you've met. <laughs> Give you my number. I'll swear to Bye, John. He's trouble. Does he know how to fight fires? No. Oh, okay. Well, well. He will mess you up. He's no good. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I killed a man. Shmi, I, I didn't mean to. He got in the way of my car. I'd been having a couple drinks. Show Shmi me that. Show me that. Oh my God. <laughs> I just ran over a guy. <laughs> yeah. Go back. <laughs> 
I think I'm gonna have to make a run for it to Mexico. You New choice. I think I'm gonna have to make a run for it to Canada. New choice. I think I'm gonna assume his identity. <laughs> <laughs> and I need your help with the prosthetics. Show me that! <laughs> Raccoons wash their food before they eat it. Screw <laughs> you are a character. Now put on my eyebrows. <laughs> Take a seat. Um, Peg. Hug, Meg. I can't even remember my name. That's salt in the wound. <laughs> Hug, I got something to tell you. <laughs> Um, the, the, the weekend trip I took with the old boys, uh -huh. we all got married. <laughs> Dude, this is a great trip. I, I haven't had enough hug. Oh. Oh. Aww. This, is, this is nice. Guys, do you just wanna... Is this legally binding? Is it a legally binding hug? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this hug is legally binding. Go back. So <laughs> <laughs> you married all the guys? All the guys. <laughs> Fire bell alarm. <laughs> Chief, I don't know what to do. Somebody said fire to the Hugs. to the Rain. toilet. <laughs> oh God! Show this me that. again. <laughs> <laughs> Inner monologue. <laughs> I'm a complicated man. <laughs> Nobody here knows how to put out fires? Um, well, I, I guess I could. Um, fire's that red stuff, right? Yeah, it's got a little orange in it, too. Oh, I've never dealt with that. <laughs> um, it's kind of, oh, I think it's spreading to the other uh, We need to get the... Plunger. Sponges. Scarf. Sponges. Sponges. <laughs> Yeah, we gotta get him. No, I didn't think about that. I think John has him. John, you're... Hello, honey. Sit down, sir. I'm for a moment. <laughs> I'm sorry if I was overly familiar. It's just that you look like the honey to me. <laughs> like beautiful golden honey. Flowing down the mountainside. <laughs> Sir, you are here today to talk about your issues with setting toilets aflame. <laughs> Would you like to go to dinner with me? Excuse me, excuse me, madam, madam. There, there's a fire in the ladies' lavatory. <laughs> what I've, did you do? I've been very busy. <laughs> do you know how well this job pays? The ladies' room, really, sir. I. I I am an equal opportunity arsonist. I set fire to the men's room too. I set fire to the men's room as well. Thank you. <laughs> Hi, I'm Meg. Thanks for meeting me. You are incredibly pugnacious. Oh. <laughs> See. <Thank you. laughs> okay, that was our first long form of the night. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Woo! Woo! Okay, we're gonna play a game called. Mad Liberation, and some of you helped us write these down. We got these tubs here with locations and phrases and problems, and throughout the scene, they're gonna just grab these and have to read them verbatim and try to justify them within the scene. So, can I have Katie, Taylor, and Shanna up here? <laughs> they're gonna grab that because they're starter suggestions, so. <laughs> Well, Bob, dance like no one's watching. I can't dance now. anymore. Now. I'm being sunburnt. Good. <laughs> My skin is all chapped and flaky. I can't dance anymore. That's what happens when you go to the place where I was proposed to. Aww. <laughs> By you. Oh, I thought you were talking about Ted again. <laughs> I told you never to bring up Ted. You keep bringing him up. I didn't bring him up. I talked about the place where you proposed to me. Well, I, I don't remember that much. Me thinks this lady doth protest too much. <laughs> you know I don't like.
like to talk about Ted. He's the reason, he's the reason I keep forgetting your morals. <laughs> For a time. What's wrong with you? Did I Ted have no morals? It only happens when you bring him up. Ted? Fancy Ted from Hamlet's house? <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing in our house, Ted? <laughs> the door was open. And she called me. Earlier. You called Ted? Listen, um... This is why our marriage doesn't work. That and not being as cool as Tim Franklin. <laughs> well, you know why what? Why can't he be as cool as Tim? You know what? I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> yeah, baby, you sexy. You don't know it. You don't. <laughs> Maybe I would know it if you showed me some of the sex instead of bringing around Ted all the time. You know how many nights I stay here and I'm, I just, darn tootin'. <laughs> I don't want an end to that sentence. <laughs> yeah, well maybe, maybe they bring me to you. The sexy brings. This is too much. I think, I think we should all just go to the gravesite of miscarriaged ideas. <laughs> Maybe there will be a movie you, you told Ted? <laughs> she told me so hard. You man. told him? That doesn't go there! <laughs> <laughs> well, it does if you know how to put it in there right. See? <laughs> and that was mad liberation. Yay. So I decided I'm gonna break it down right now. And get to know you guys a little bit better. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. So, uh, how'd your guys' week go? Good week? Bad week? Good, good week. Good good week. Good. Anything well, exciting good. happen? No. Mm. Come on, guys. <laughs> I saw a bunch of robots today. Robots? Really? Yeah. Were they any of the people up here? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> Couldn't have been. So anything else happened this week? Modular server. Modular yeah. server? Yeah, install GNU Linux on it. That was we exciting. sure don't. GNU Linux, cool. Yeah, open source, all the way. Free software. Yes. I was stuck in prison for eight hours. Stuck in prison for eight hours. Let's go with that one. So could you tell us a little bit more about why you were stuck in prison? Um, people wouldn't give me their tickets. I was stuck inside there for relay for life, and everyone kept on throwing me back in there after I got out. And in one case, I got dragged from bearing all the way to the armory by the floor to get thrown back into prison. Jeez, that sounds rough. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I'm glad you're out now, though, and here. So I guess you guys didn't have a very exciting week. So let's just go anywhere. Tell me something terrifying that has happened to you in your life. It's a big span of time. I got my foot caught in a bike. Ow! Like so uh, how did you how did you do that? Well, I don't know. <laughs> it does not happen. You don't know. So you were riding your bike, and then all of a sudden, bam, foot. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I'm sure that was like within pedaling, and then my foot got caught, and then I just kind of, you know. Spoke. Well, you eventually got the bike off. Yeah. It seems. I can buy a cable guy. Oh, okay. By a cable guy. Yeah, he stopped, pulled over, asked if I was okay, and then helped me get my foot off. I'm sorry. And how old were you when this happened? Probably like seven or eight. Ouch. Oh, I thought this was like yesterday. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I had a bookshelf fall on me just about an hour ago. Whoa. Okay, so how did that happen? Uh, what is it called? A, uh... Bookshelf? A book? <laughs> <laughs> put the books on top and then just start studying beneath it without wondering if it was structurally sound. <laughs> so yes, did you sustain any injuries? I mean, if it just um, happened, it look, you're looking pretty good for wall, it. Wall, but <laughs> everything's okay. I'm glad to hear that. I'm yeah. glad to hear that. So let me just get one like wonderful experience. Like, What family vacation did you take and you're like, oh man, when I think of vacation, that's all I think about. Let's have a story about that. Come on, I guys. I went to a Hawaiian luau. Hawaiian luau? Yes. I went to Italy. I'll take Italy. Jelly. I already, I already <laughs> so, Italy, tell me about Italy. Uh, my family, we went with my grandparents because they were turning 70. Wow. Did your family the mafia? <laughs> <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> so, I mean, did you enjoy it? Did you see any of the sites that they have there? Yeah. 
Yeah. It's very hard to get places jelly. in Tuscany. Jelly. Very yeah. jelly. Did you see the Pope? We did see the Pope. Uh -huh. Woo! Oh. Pope. Pope. Oh. Oh. Less of jelly. <laughs> well, Good the Pope or touch. new Pope? <laughs> Crystal Pope. <laughs> Classic. Classic. <laughs> well, thank you all for interacting. Uh, we're going to take these suggestions and we're going to apply it to another long form. Everything we heard out here, everything we heard during the show, we're going to use it as, as uh, influence for what we do. So, can I get two people up here? We need three new. Oh, that's right. I'm going to have to take your powers away, I'm sorry. <laughs> because i got to give them to new people. i got to give more people a chance. I'll take hers. <laughs> um, I'm hosting the show, so I will decide. <laughs> well, you gotta be that way. Um, inner monologue. Can I get another volunteer? We'll, we'll put the second row in there, too. You? Okay. Uh, what's your name? Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Oh, Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Hi, Chelsea. Inner monologue. Need to re-explain, or do you got it? Got it. Cool. Uh, Oscar-winning moment. Okay, what's your name? Kim. Kim. Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Hi, Kim. Your shirt's pretty. Thank you. We're also complimenting everybody in the audience. So you have Oscar winning moments, just yell that out whenever you feel. And then uh, show me that. Uh, can I have someone to show me that? You right there. Uh, what is your name? Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. Hey, Ryan. Take it from me. Is it Ryan? Ryan? Uh, I think it's Ryan. Ryan? Ryan. 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 Okay. Like an orange. Like Ryan. 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 So, Ryan, um, you have show me that, and you can yell that out at any time. So, now that we've got the new powers, let's start this up. Welcome to prison. <laughs> Happy to be here. Uh, yeah, glad to hear it. Uh, Did I start a package or what? Do I, uh, yeah, yeah. Wait, guest a... passes? Yeah, yeah, you get. I got some friends I want to bring, and I don't. They want to pay. For yeah, I understand the concept of guest passes, sir. <laughs> okay, uh, you bringing any knives in? Um, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Two knives. <laughs> Seems fair. If you end up bringing in three, just let me know. Okay. Um, you want to be in? Do I get pets? <laughs> Do you have a pet? I have a fish. Okay, because we don't provide pets. Oh, I get that. We're a prison, not a pet store. I have a fish. Can I have a fish? I fresh, water, it's, fresh water or salt water? It's a, it's a salt water tank. Ah, uh, that's, that's kind of... It's, that's only five gallons. <laughs> Marty! Uh, listen, Danny, I'm, I'm sorry. Um... Can you maybe just figure out a better way to put your bookshelf back? You know, I'm trying to study, and then I hear your books falling like every 15 minutes, and it's Show really me that. <laughs> Bing bong, bing bong. Ah! Bing bong, bing bong. Ooh. I have a calculus test tomorrow. <laughs> books falling. <laughs> Look, I'm just doing what Mom told me. <laughs> Show me that! <laughs> Boy. Yeah, Mom? You let your books fall. All the time. They back in the closet, set Mom. <laughs> books fall. It's all due. Thanks for the advice. Go back. <laughs> hey, B. Found the kill on the side of the road with her foot in a bike, so I just brought her back. <laughs> Put her in the cable van, brought her back. Okay, Larry. What can we use her for? Cable company. Not girl storage. <laughs> can we show me that. <laughs> okay, just stack them together. Stack them together. Just kind of smush them in. I'm Tiffany. It's so good to meet you. Go back. They get her I don't know what we're gonna do with a girl. You know, we can, uh, you know, you uh, type. Why is her foot still in the bike? Well, I couldn't get it out. <laughs> There's a, all I had was channel lock, so I could pop her foot off. <laughs> I can still do that. See, this is your problem. <laughs> your Excellency, the people are looking for a new 
<laughs> a locale pope. <laughs> pope with no trans fat. Kids today, they're obsessed with running and, and being fit, so I was thinking like Pope Zero or <laughs> Oh, there goes one. Some sort of blue pope. A citrus pope. Uh, maybe we use real sugar. A cherry pope. A cherry pope. I like that. So I thought, starting tomorrow, we could start you on a new regimen. Maybe a new hat. This one is kind of sweaty. <laughs> Sure do love Italy. <laughs> Have you heard about the new Pope? <laughs> Gerald. He's cherry scented. <laughs> you told me five times about the new Pope. Oh, the new Pope! Have you heard about him? Inner <laughs> <laughs> yes. <Peter's> dialogue. <laughs> Seventy years I've been with this man. <laughs> Seventy years we talk about popes. <laughs> Just one thing like him to ask me about my shows. Or my love life, since he's not providing. Oh. <laughs> Gerald, let's just go back to the July place. Hey, Don. Hey, the cops are on my tail. <laughs> Show me that. <laughs> You'll never catch me. <laughs> Ciao. You'll never Ciao. <laughs> Jail. 
I'm going to jail. But they have to find both pieces to make sure it's the right match. Is right? that a jigsaw puzzle, you moron? <laughs> and if we just hide it. Hey, yeah, uh, this is my friend. Yeah, I need a guest pass. <laughs> you got ID? You got your ID. Oh, oh, yeah. I live here. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't remember. Really... Cell block four. <laughs> oh, you're a little fourie. I got the fish. What ID, sir? Guest pass. <laughs> this is fake. No, it's not fake. No, it's clearly fake. No. I used to have curly hair. Yeah. I've never even heard of Hawaii-Daho. That's his name. <laughs> his mother named him Hawaii-Daho. <laughs> yeah, hey, buddy, Dad. That guy's always getting into mischief. Yeah. Not like you, Gerald. You know, I was thinking, if you were into it, maybe we could go see the Pope. <laughs> Beautiful hat, sir. <laughs> I wonder how Cardinal... Fitzgerald feels about Pope with lime. <laughs> you're, you're Sorry, your pet has a top heavy. Your pet. I was thinking we should add some. Oh. Oh. <laughs> did, did, it just, did it just get cold? <laughs> the Pope with lime. <laughs> with the lime and the Pope. <laughs> I know, but I didn't think when I got you the musical bookshelf that you were going to play the music all night long. Shall we bump? Bing bong, 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 bing bong. Enjoy. Bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. This bookshelf yesterday. Bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. Who's the next cute little kid? And now performing his concerto in E flat. Some kid's name with his musical bookshelf. Bing bong, bing bong. <laughs> bing bong, bing bong. Bing 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 choice. <laughs> so I hope you all enjoyed that, because that was fun. <laughs> We're going to close out the night with a game called Countdown. Now this game is for Katie, Shannon, Will, Rachel, Mona, and Tim. So divvy up faster. Uh, uh.
Okay, so the way this game works is they're gonna, these guys over here are gonna start a scene and they're gonna have a minute to do it. And then these guys are gonna do the same scene in 30 seconds. Pass it back over here for 15, seven, and then seven backwards. So, can I have a suggestion of a location that you would not go to? The moon. Or is there be nightmares? <laughs> I didn't hear it, I'm sorry. A walrus Send cage. Us the walrus cage is your suggestion. And go. Dude, this is not what I signed up for. SeaWorld, SeaWorld sucks. SeaWorld, please don't hug me. I don't. Please don't. Okay, okay, okay. I'll get your fish. I'll get your fish, man. Here's your, here's your fish. Eat your, eat your fish. And we're all good. We're all good. I really wish that Tina hadn't left me here. No, fish. Where the hell are you, Tina? Hi. Tina. I'm Tina. <laughs> Did you hug the walrus yet? No. Oh. It wants, it just wants hugs. Yeah. 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 Stupid. Stupid. Hey. Stupid. Come here, walry. The walrus. Is its name? I named it Walry. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I just. Can we make. Hug the walrus. Hug it. Oh. Hug it. I don't do group hugs. You hug together. <laughs> okay. Now, can I see that same scene? But do it in 30 seconds. And. <laughs> begin. Again, we are at Liberation. You can find us on the internet at adliberation.net. We're on Twitter at adlibimprov, facebook.com slash adliberation. This show, along with a lot of our previous shows, minus some of the video, is online. You can check out our website. <laughs> Woo! 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 Yeah. Woo! Websites! Yes! Facebook.com! Yes. <laughs> <laughs> guys, come on. Oh, oh. I'll, I'll, I'll like read out your names. Our next show is the 27th. Our next show is the 27th. 27. And at the first Sunday of every month, we have open forum. Or open, open not open forum. Practice. Oh, open practice. Oh, practice. practice. Uh -huh. That was a long uh -huh. uh, Open practice where you can come and, and do improv with us. It's in store at 307 from 1 to 3, so you totally should do that. Come play with us. Exactly. <laughs> We're nice. I'm Matt. And a good one, Katie. Mona. <laughs> Tim. Will. Rachel. Taylor. <laughs> Shannon. Thank you! Thank you. <laughs> One more set! You don't have anything else. Uh, Jimmy.